Good morning, Junior School, and welcome to the first ever vertical lesson within the Junior School and within the Leadership Lesson. Now, this is really exciting. We've been looking forward to this for a very long time. We have, unfortunately, been prohibited over the last couple of years with all of the COVID issues that have been going on. But now is the time to really come together as a community and learn together, whether you're in year three, year four, year five, or year six. The whole aim of leadership is to develop ourselves as people and develop ourselves to be the very best people we can be. And if we combine all of our good uh, skills that we're going to learn and all of our good personality traits into one great big community from years three to six, imagine what a kind and loving school we're going to be. So to start off with, because I know there will be some people in the class who you are not sure who they are, I'm going to set you a challenge. Your challenge is you've got one minute to learn the name of someone who you've never spoken to before in a room and find out three of their favourite things to do. Once you've found those out, your teacher will ask you to explain a couple of good things about the people who you found out about. I'll see you in a second. Awesome, so we already know who we are now, which is one step to becoming a really good community and one step to showing brilliant kindness to each other at all times. If you see your uh, teammates and your groups around school now, you know their name, you can say hello to them at every single time, whether in your year, in your year three, year four, year five, or year six. Awesome, right. So, what is leadership all about? So, over the next two lessons, you are going to be learning and working together in groups uh, about some keywords, and today's keywords are kindness and honesty. After half term, you're then going to be working together on projects, but I'll explain more about those closer to the time. So, kindness and honesty, two very big words in our nature. It's amazing to be kind, and it's really important to be honest. Let's have a little look at this video and see what you think. This little number is from the first day I became security moose. Oh, it's very delicate. That's a great pen, Mr. O. Mm. Yeah, thanks for showing us your pen collection. Oh, any time, kids. Literally, any time. Oh, I live to talk about pens and to patrol. Oh, speaking of which, break time's over. Come on, everyone, oh, let's get back to work. Hop, 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 hop. Ooh, what's this? Looks like a Mr. Orlando classic pen. Let me see that. Come, come here. Ah! I broke it. Oh no, Mr. Orlando will be so mad. He'll be so mad. Oh, I've got to hide it. Rudolph Yonga! Looks like that's a job for. The Knights of Kindness! We are the Knights of Kindness! Huzzah! Kind are we! We always mind our P's and Q's From sea to shiny sea Manners matter! Halt, young kitty cat! In the name of Sir Thanks a lot. And I also, Sir Thanks very much. Uh, I wasn't doing anything. Were you not? No, no, I was definitely not hiding Mr. Orlando's pen that I accidentally broke. Well, it sounds to me like you were hiding Mr. Orlando's pen that you accidentally broke. Mm. Uh, fine, I did it, but but how can I ever tell him? Oh, he'll be so upset. And how mm. doth you think he'd feel if he knew that you were hiding it from him? Hmm. I think that would make him feel even more disappointed. Mm-hmm. I have to tell him. Mm, that sounds like a good idea, young Meow Meow. You can do it. We believeth in you. I can do it. It will be hard, but being honest is the right thing to do. Thanks, Knights of Kind... Kindness? And like that, they were gone. Mm -mm -mm. Hi, Cotton Ball. I'm just here to get my... <sighs> Special pen. Uh, about that, Mr. Orlando, I'm really sorry, but I accidentally...
accidentally broke your pen. Yeah. Oh, my first day on the job pen. Oh, no. Well, I'm really sorry. I promise I'll get you a new pen. Uh, yeah, well, actually, you know what, Cotton Ball? It's probably time for a, an addition to the old pen family anyway. But thanks for telling me. Hug? Sure. Oh, mm. That's okay. I'm sorry. Huzzah for kindness! Huzzah! Good. Well, it's interesting, isn't it? Because the first reaction there was to hide the pen. However, that wouldn't have been kind or honest. Because Mr. Moose would have worried where his pen has gone. So, thank goodness that uh, she got persuaded to tell the truth and be honest about it and show kindness to Mr. Moose by offering to get him a new pen or replace it. We need to remember this at all times in every aspect of our life, that kindness is the most important thing. We have to be kind to each other. If we're not kind to each other, we upset people. And that's really sad. I hate people seeing people upset. It makes me feel sad. Especially if it's because someone's been unkind. So we always need to make sure that we're being kind to people. Honesty, hugely important, because then we can trust each other. With honesty comes trust. And trust is hugely important to build relationships, and this is what it's all about. So, your challenge today, you're going to be in groups of four, one person from each different age group, year three, year four, year five, year six, and then you are going to think about what kindness means to you to start off with. I want you to think of examples where you've been kind to other people, and we're going to share those with the class. And then once you've done that, I want you to think about what you can do to spread kindness throughout Clifton High School. Have a really good think about it and come up with some ideas and then you're going to feed those back to your class too. So the first task is all about kindness. After kindness, we're going to do exactly the same for honesty. Can you think of times when you've been really honest and brave to be honest? And then, what can we do around Clifton High School to improve the honesty of all pupils and staff, to really promote how good it is to be honest and build the trust within the community? Remember, we're very, very lucky to be part of Clifton High School. And it is an amazing community already, but can we make it even better? That is the overall aim. So I hope you enjoyed today. I hope you've made some new friends. And I hope you work together really constructively, tricky words, see if you know what that means, really constructively to break down any barriers and to make everyone feel welcome and show everyone the very best kindness you possibly can. Enjoy.